Sure. I'm not up for that. You gotta go up there and close that window anyway, Bubba. Okay, guys, Prepper Nurse 1 here. Let me show you what we got here. Obviously, there's the stairs. The. Okay, lock it up, honey. This is the. Hi. I am Adam Jesse Cosmo of Travel North Run, and this is my crib. And, uh, you, you can see, see, see now, there are some guys from. MTV standing outside. Yeah, there you go. MTV Cribs. Yeah, so. Don't do that. It's Relax. <laughs> so we got the back Don't walls up me, and no. insulated now. Um, all of Eddie's area is done. Only thing that's got to just put more of the plywood's got to come over here. But what we're going to end up doing for him is he's going to have a wall that comes up over to here, down to this point here, and then this will get hooked up to that wall. And then it's going to have um, the other one's going to come over there. And then over in the front here, where this part is here, where Heather's sitting, is going to be another wall. So he'll be kind of boxed in up here, which will be good for him. And in this way, mm -hmm. hopefully it won't get too hot. Relax. Oh, you're just looking? Yeah. Yeah. So, but yep, all the uh, the plywood and his. Don't. No, 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 no. You wait and come down the stairs. We're keeping him in jail. That's why all this is. I'm going to leave that on a second, please. Thank you. It's, it's, a, it's a gay baby jail. Yeah, it's all right. So, um, <laughs> got the plywood up more here. So, his area is now ready to go for now. We're going to have. Um, the beds are going to be delivered tomorrow. Oh. So, so, he's going to have his mattress is going to come up. Dad. Yes, Bubba. My only gripe about this is, is that, like, I, I, I can't, like, it's just everything before my head, like. It's short. Yes, I, 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 it, it is short, and I am a big guy. Yes, you are a big guy. <laughs> and and if, if you take my mask off, it'll be extremely painful <laughs> for you. All right, well, relax. So, anyway, so here's, he's got his area here pretty much squared away up here now. And uh, he's got a lot of room. He doesn't have a lot of headroom, of course. But, <laughs> I can grind it, of course. But that's, you know, you gotta, you'll gotta. be stretched out all half the time anyway on your laptop anyway. I can grind it, of course. Uh, exactly. And then now down in Heather's room, her closet has got the shelf up here now. So you can see the shelf. And then uh, we're going to get like a, a rod that, you know, you would push in here. So she can hang her clothes up here. And he just, what he did for now, is he just screwed that piece in till we get the hinges and then we can get the hinges and put that on so we have access underneath the stairs. And uh, so, and her other part of the ceiling is now done. So this is all squared away. And uh, so, like I said, the, the beds are being delivered tomorrow. So we're gonna actually work on getting this cleaned out and Actually, tomorrow might be the day we end up doing all this type of stuff. Anyway, the beds are being delivered, I think, at like 12.30. So we are going to uh, work on uh, getting things squared away in here so that we can get everything set up. And, but, here, here you are. So what did you think? I didn't look at my room yet. Well, go look in your room. Well, I look when I'm ready. When you're ready? Yeah. Come on, go tell, take a look. I want, you, I want you to see what you, see what you think. So, um, this has been built up over the top of here now, obviously, and, uh, look in your closet. I did. There's a shelf. There's a shelf and your ceiling's up now. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, but, uh, I wanted him to focus on their rooms first so that we can kind of get them settled in and then they can start sleeping in their rooms and not have to sleep on the floor, which is what we've been doing. So, um after tomorrow when we get the beds then tomorrow night they can sleep in their rooms pretty cool I guess. you guess yes. don't sound so excited heather <laughs> heather your, your excitement is just palpable yes yeah. yes all right so anyway so a lot more stuff done today um like i said probably tomorrow is going to be more of getting the rooms arranged settled in getting things kind of squared away that way and uh we're just you know keep plugging along at this and uh it's uh, coming together. Oh, and uh, the other thing that got done in here is over over the window, that piece got put in. That was just a little button-up stuff. So, 
but yeah well, now the door's got to go in of course but uh you know that, that that'll be another day but uh just, we're getting there we're getting there and uh, i'm happy with the progress real happy with the progress so it is uh coming together and uh so these pieces weren't on here the other day so now they are and uh huh behind you on the ceiling huh yes those ones but yeah so it looks pretty cool i mean it's uh you know it's a work in progress and uh we're getting there so anyway guys listen i hope everybody has a great day um today is monday the 22nd or tuesday sorry tuesday the 22nd lose time already i've only been back to work one day um and uh it rained like all day today i mean it was like a non-stop rain all day it finally stopped yeah. yeah so it's uh a wet rainy day up here today it stopped now but everything's good so all right listen i will talk to you guys tomorrow and remember guys you know it's one thing at a time one step at a time one day at a time you're gonna get there you're gonna reach your goals you just got to be very methodical have a game plan and stick to it a thousand mile march starts with one step that's right a thousand mile march starts with one step that's as easy as that. I mean, you can't start the journey unless you do it. And uh, you can't be scared. You know, that's the thing. It's like, you know, um, the biggest thing, too, I would say is if you want instant gratification, this is not for you. It's definitely not for you. Instant gratification? Okay. Some album of a band she listens to. But, um, you know, you you know have to realize that it takes time and you know every little victory that you get it's just I don't know for me it's just it's exciting it, it really is I mean the day we got the wood stove in I was real excited now it's not even on we haven't had it on all day because it's been in the 50s today so we have not even had the wood stove going and uh, it's been very comfortable I actually had the kids let it burn out last night because How do you have to open a window? I believe it so, anyway, guys, listen, I'm going to let you go now. Have a great day, and I will talk to you tomorrow. All right? Prepper Nurse went out for now.